I've gone through a lot of ups and downs, and I guess there's a reason why I, I could think God put me on this earth for me to go through hard times, like, because I do it so gracefully, and I do it with a lot of strength to help other people out there. But I'm all about the love, love, love. You really get to know me, you'll know that I really am all about that. What makes me feel sexier every day is working out because I like to keep my body tight. I got in great shape. We're doing the bikini fitness competition, dancing with the stars. Like, but if I gain any weight, it'll go straight to my ass. Like Louis is it? He says he likes my ass. So I guess it's a good thing, you know. When I first met Louis, like you know, when you're so in love and that's all you do is go out to eat and drink. I did gain like five to 10 pounds and Louis said the same, like he did too. You know, we both have always worked out. So before our wedding, like we made sure like we hit the gym like religiously. I don't eat so many carbs because I love pasta. I'm Italian, so I love my carbs. So I just try to watch what I eat. But someone told me that pineapple makes you taste really good. <laughs> so I'm just obsessed. But if you come to my house, you'll always find pineapple in my refrigerator. What makes Louis sexy to me, like the way he looks, his brains, his body, his heart, the way he treats my children, the way he treats me. The most amazing thing that he ever did that I was blown, there's two things. For um, our one year anniversary, he took me on a, on a yacht, like out in New York City. It was on the show, matter of fact. And he wrote this beautiful poem, like everything that he loved about me on a canvas. And then this year, he booked this amazing birthday for me. We went to Playa del Carmen. We took like a private jet there and he invited like 10 or 12 of my friends and got them all sweets and everything. It was amazing. Yeah, he's like, well, you only turned 50 once. He always like wows me. There was stuff going on, you know, and people trying to hurt our love bubble. And I totally ignored all of that that was happening. Louie and I, we communicate, we don't even fight. It's so easy, like it's, it's like really like amazing. It really is. This year I turned 50. I'm fine with it. I mean, how do I look for my age? If anything, I, I feel like I look better now than from when I first started the show. I look at how my makeup was when I first started the show compared to how my makeup is now. It's so much better. I know I like my hair better now. I'm not wearing any makeup. And you know what? I'm trying to embrace that a little bit more. And everyone tells me I look better without makeup. The only thing I've ever done, I've done my, my breasts and my nose. But I mean, my beauty tr trick is like, be confident in who you are. I have a new king. Good job. Finally! But I'm still the queen of New Jersey. It's Real Hustlers in New Jersey. It's drama, 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 and I'm the OG. So of course, everyone wants to come after the OG, right? Because I don't think this person that I'm portrayed on TV is actually the person that I really am. Really, in my real life, there's like really no drama. I'm all about just enjoying life, like live every day like it's your last. And that's what I'm unapologetic for.